LeBron James and the LA Lakers are about to get physical, specifically with a link of the Utah Jazz. LeBron gets called for the foul here as a link is driving to the basket, but LeBron actually stays down on the ground. Uh, this has been a frustrating game for LeBron. LeBron. First half of this game, he scores six points, uh, does not look very good, gets gets frustrated in a couple of plays that we're going to see coming up here. It's about three minutes left in the half now, and Utah is starting to just run away with this game. On this specific play, Olink is driving to the basket and catches LeBron with his elbow. At least that's what it looks like. We're going to see a slowdown of it again in just a second. So I don't think LeBron necessarily fouled Olink. But there was contact being made. It looked like Olink initiated it right in the neck area. Um, he makes the basket. He gets the three throw. LeBron gets the foul. So, you know, 90 seconds later when LeBron has the ball, I think we all know what he's looking to do. He ends up dishing out the ball here. Sets a moving screen against Sexton. No call. Probably going to get called 50-50 in the NBA. That's just the way it is. Uh, and then Olink's coming down the court and LeBron just kind of charges into him and sends him flying to the ground. The first time I saw that, I thought it was a dirty play. Olink gets right back up and hits the three. Beautiful. Uh, I thought this was dirty LeBron. I watched it several times and it's definitely, definitely contact. I don't think it's dirty. Uh, he's, you know, setting the screen. Olink flops 100%. I'm so glad that refs aren't calling this. But there needs to be consequences for when you do flop. A link hits the three, so he kind of wins that battle here. LeBron drives here and spends the next 32 seconds complaining to the referee without getting a technical foul. Is there anybody else in the NBA that can get away with this? I know Luka does a lot of this. I know Chris Paul does a lot of this. But 30 seconds seems a little extreme to me. I don't know if they gave him a warning, if they told him to walk away. He just kept going and going and going. And when you see the replay, I don't really know what he's upset about. Here he is, a uh, different angle. He's driving. There's contact. But it didn't look like a foul to me. If anything, you know, LeBron's elbow goes into the sternum here. That's not going to get called most of the time. The second half is about to be closed out. LeBron makes a great read here, gets the ball, can't keep the handle on it on the breakaway. So we're going to end the first half 75 to 62. LeBron has six points. LeBron is struggling this game. Uh, the Lakers are struggling defensively, specifically against the Utah Jazz. Here LeBron finds again another ref to, to complain to. Uh, frustrating game for LeBron. And you can see some of that physicality here in the second half.